hey everyone and welcome back to our channel in today's video we are going to show you how to connect google calendar with clickup let's begin now the first thing that you need to do is to log in using your credentials if this is your first time here with clickup i need you to click the sign up option and from here just to follow with the on-screen instructions and you're good to go connecting google calendar with clickup is a straightforward process that would help you sync your tasks and events ensuring that all your deadlines meetings and other important dates are organized in one place all right so here's how you can connect google calendar with clickup on the native option here for the clickup account i want you to click on the uh, quick action menu and there's going to be an option that says app center we're in all I have to do, as you can see, Google Calendar is already here as one of the most featured and favorite popular integrations. If you can't find Google Calendar by any chance, just search, type in Google Calendar. For example, you can't see it. All right, but the suggestion is pointing you to Google Calendar. Let's click that. Now you have multiple options. You can have the personal, the workspace. You can have all of these features, two-way sync to Google Calendar, sync task to Calendar, launch your next meeting. All right, I'm going to click on the workspace. Click on that. And of course, from here, just authorize the platforms and click up once to access your Google account and click on continue. Wait for it and there's going to be a status bar. If the uh, integration is successful as you can see it's connected you can now have a two way to sync to google calendar and sync tasks to google to calendar now for us to make sure that the integration is successful i want you to go to the home screen there's going to be an option here for the calendar as you can see this is going to be today you see the calendar is connected you can add the calendar and that's going to be this right here Click on add, and that's going to be for deep laughs, all right? Launch your next meetings. And of course, you can always open the Google Calendar as you want it, all right? You see that? Calendar is here, and voila. Now, I'm going to switch to my Google Calendar to see if it's working. And as you can see, the integration is quite successful. Let's click on it. There you go. Now, another option that we can explore is using Zapier, wherein you can simply connect ClickUp to Google Calendar and automate your work. All right. And from here, just click on this orange button to connect these apps and have all this endless possibilities. If you do that, we will be forwarded to our Zap. We can rename the Zap as something like this one now if you are a fan of our deep laughs youtube channel you know that we have so many zapier tutorials available in our channel that you might want to check out all right and if you haven't already you might want to click the subscribe button so you'll get notifications whenever we upload new contents and for your information guys we upload daily all right now i'm switching back to the zapier because from here, we need to select the event for ClickUp. And that's going to be a trigger event. You can choose new comment on a task. It triggers when a new comment is added to a task in ClickUp. Or are you going to select triggers when new folders are created? Or maybe it triggers when new lists are at, created or triggers when tasks are created. So depending on your goals and uh, uh, preferences, you might want to click the... Uh, option but for now i'm going to choose the first one you have this account already all right and click on continue now you should choose the work workspace and that's going to be deep laughs how to tutorials this space is going to be um deep laughs folder is going to be no folder for now list is going to be um Maybe this one for now. This is for example. And the task is going to be for deep laugh link task. Users is going to be deep laughs. And you can fetch all task data. 
I'm gonna put in true. Click on continue. You can now test the trigger to see if it's working. Because once it's successful, you can track progress on tasks and ensure that you have the accountability by having a clear view of the deadlines in both ClickUp and Google Calendar. Once you're happy with that, all you're going to do is click on the action event going for the Google Calendar. For example, it triggers when you can add attendees to event, invites one or more person to an existing event, create calendar, create an event by defining each field, all deletes an event. But for now, create a new calendar to make it a lot easier. I'm going to sign into my Google Calendar account. And I'm going to authorize this and follow the on-screen instructions. Wait for it. And from here, Google Calendar is a secure partner with a Zapier. Just click on continue. For example, I'm going to enter this and the description is that. I'm going to click on continue to make sure that Google Calendar is accessible from any device with internet access, allowing you to view and manage your ClickUp tasks on the go wherever you are. All right. Once you're happy with that, all you have to do is sit back and relax because Zapier will do all the work for you. Now, another platform that you can explore is using Make.com, wherein you can connect ClickUp and Google Calendar integrations. And of course, you can choose the trigger like Zapier. For example, it triggers when a specific folder event happens. And then the action for the Google Calendar is going to be clear a calendar. I'm going to log into my account. Now, we're going to create a new scenario. The first one we're going to look for is the Google Calendar. All right, just wait for it. Type in Google Calendar. There you go. Click on that. And triggers when an event is created, updated, deleted, started, or ended in a selected calendar. Click on it. Click on connections. And of course, just sign in with Google and follow the on-screen instructions. Allow, just like Zapier. Of course, you can select the calendar that's going to be um, deep flaps. Click on OK. And the next module is going to be click up. Type the click up here. List all tasks. And there you go. All I'm going to do is click on OK. You can sit back and relax because the make.com will do all the work for you. And of course, by streamlining these platforms, you can improve your workflow, time management, and enhance overall productivity by keeping all their schedules and tasks in sync. Thank you so much for watching. We will see you again in the next video.